This is a video about my carriage. This is the carriage that I use for special occasions. It's a, uh, it was custom built and uh, here in Ontario. Uh, not for me, it was built for another uh, driver, but it's a um, four wheeled carriage cut under has a full circle steering on it. This carriage is called a Victoria and it's available for weddings, anniversaries, uh, proms, graduations, proposals, any occasion that you would like a romantic carriage ride. And the top folds down uh, three different ways. This is fully up. The top is up and the back curtain is uh, closed, buttoned down. You can leave the top up and roll the back up here. You just undo these buttons and then it rolls up and it just latches up with leather uh, leather loops. Or you can just fold it down uh, part way or it can be completely collapsed just like a convertible car. So you can have essentially an open carriage. Most people seem to prefer uh, the top up. Gives a little bit more privacy. But one of the features of this carriage is it um, the front wheels are slightly narrower than the rear wheels and it's cut low to allow ease of entry. This step here is nice and wide and it's about 8 to 10 inches off the ground and then there's an intermediate step and there's a nice wide platform there so it's easy particularly if you're in heels to uh, get on and off and there's lots of room uh, it's made for two uh, there is a small seat here this is for like a flower girl or a page boy a very young child would sit on that seat it just folds out as needed so this is the uh, this is the passenger compartment. It's a carriage built for two, essentially, and you can use your imagination. Um, it's very good for taking photographs, uh, particularly from this angle, uh, because there's no doors or pillars or posts in the way. It's not like a closed-in carriage, uh, so it's it's very good for photographs. This is the driver's seat up here. It has a vinyl seat. as the cloth seat back here, and this is just a vinyl seat because it's out in the weather. And then the rubber floor mats and the leather dashboard. It has hydraulic brakes, a, a welded steel frame, uh, the patent leather fenders, and a steel tongue. It can be used with one horse. I normally use it with a pair just for... Uh, Easy. It's quite a heavy carriage, or it can even be, I can hook four horses on it if you want to make a statement. And, uh, yeah, so, the, uh, I'll just get back so you can have an overall view of it. My camera is not the best camera, that's for sure. There's a little cargo box at the back here. Luggage box. I keep spares in it. I usually keep a spare lead shank. Spare halters. Uh, going on an extended drive, I'll actually take uh, spare reins, spare bridle, just spares. It's handy to have things for spare. So... Alright, that's it. If you're interested, this is what the carriage is like. It has a cloth, cloth interior, and uh, it's, I guess it's a, like a, a rose mauve sort of interior, and it's a royal blue uh, hand-painted um, stenciling all over it on the wheels. It's all hand painted. So.